Hello, everybody. Welcome. Today, we are going to learn how to make a Venn diagram in Word. Okay, so this is a Venn diagram, and this is how it will look when it's done. Here are all the parts. We have some text boxes, more text boxes, a picture, two pictures, and shapes. So, to get started, the first thing we want to do is we want to insert shapes, circles. I draw a circle, a little more than half the page, and then I'm going to go to shape fill, no fill. And the shape outline, I'm going to choose um, black. Okay. Now I'm going to right click, copy, then I'm going to right click, and I'm going to go to paste. Okay, then I can just move it over. Now I have two large circles. Make sure the space in the middle is large so you can write in it. Okay, now I'm going to go to insert, go to shapes, text box. So now I'm going to make a text box up here. And um, for the text box, I'm going to center a line so the words are in the middle of the box. Okay, and I can just type in here and make the text a little larger. Okay, move the text box. And now I'm going to go to shape fill, no fill, and shape outline, no outline. This way, the text looks like it's floating. Even though it's still in a box, I can move it freely and easily. Okay, I'm going to right click and copy and paste more text boxes just like that one for the other parts. Okay, that's perfect. And I can relabel those later. For now, I'm going to insert shapes, text box again. These are going to be larger. Again, I'm going to just shape fill, no fill, and shape outline, no outline. Make a few bullet points, copy, paste, move that over, copy, paste, and move that over. Now I have all the fields that I need, and I can just label each one as I wish. And for each of these, I can just fill them out. One last thing, I want to put pictures. So I'm going to go to insert um, pictures. Oh, well, actually, I'm going to go to online pictures. That way I can search for any picture I want in the Bing database. This is not a sponsored video. I'm just going to go down. I want one with a white background just so that it looks like it's clean on the white page. So anytime I add a picture, go to layout options in front of text. Now I can resize it freely and move it around freely. And I'll just put it right there. And that's it. So once you fill out all the boxes and move all your text around and add your pictures, this is what it should look like. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell notification if you want to be alerted when I upload more videos. And if you really like this video, you should text message it to your friends in a group chat and post it on your Facebook wall. Thanks for visiting. Goodbye.